What's up, everyone? This is Bricks for you, and today we have the very first review I have filmed in weeks. I have not been feeling very well. Um, I luckily I have a couple. I have a couple other videos that I pre-filmed, but this is the very first one that I'm actually filming since the uh, haul from the toy show, and then before that, I guess it was sometime in October, I filmed my last video. So it's it's been a bit, but uh, here we have a the Republic Bricks Halo. UNSC Warthog. So we're first going to take a look at the set itself, then take a look at some custom figures that I am going to be pairing with it. So first off, it's using this amazing olive color. Unfortunately, you see right here one of the problems with public bricks. There's a uh, mark on that brick, but uh, that's you know that's what that's what happens when you buy used parts. You can see I love the um, red candlesticks being used as like looking as a uh, shock absorbers. Uh, you have this, which is, uh, I believe this is supposed to be like the little cans on the back. I don't, remember, I don't remember exactly which Halo this specific design is from. But uh, of course, here you have the turret on the back, which has slots to fit one figure. You can fit two figures inside. I love the uh, seat design. Of course, the uh, tusks on the front that are so iconic. Um, if I can just quickly grab a Warthog from... My shelf, here we have a, uh, I guess, similar-ish Warthog, but of course the Mega one. Of course this one's bigger, but this one is, I believe, to scale with figures. While I think this one is a little oversized, I'm not entirely sure if that's to scale properly with Mega or not. But uh, showing off some custom figures, I'll be pairing with this. We first, of course, have the one I've shown you before, which is the Brick Tactical Grunt. So let's put that in front of our Warthog. And then let's bring the uh, Brick Forge Master Chief. I believe this is Brick Forge. Um, well, let's throw him into the driver's seat. Oh, he matches so, so well. And then we can give the Rookie from Halo 3 ODST the uh, turret. I, I, I get some uh, Brick Tactical... Uh, Marines, I should totally put one of those into the uh, turret. And now you can see we have uh, these two chasing down the poor Ungoy. This to make this even more unfair for the Ungoy, let's just throw in uh, two of these black uh, Brick Forge ODSTs. So yes, yeah, so this is an amazing, amazing set. And of course, you know, again, I, I put a bunch of custom figures with it. But, you know, this is something that LEGO will never do, and I think that is sad, because seeing, you know, just from the set alone, I mean, again, like, just looking at this, um, all of these, you know, because you have all these bricks on the side to actually to, uh, create, of course, the side, we have these uh, little grooves to get up. I mean, you know, we, we see that this is such a well-detailed set and well-modeled set, and it's really sad that uh, LEGO... Officially, we'll probably never take a stab at something like this. Um, so yeah, that's it's just amazing. I feel like Republic Bricks are able to uh, step in and give us what, frankly, what Lego... I mean, I, I won't say Lego should give us, because I mean, I know this isn't exactly Lego's thing, but what I wish Lego would give us. So yeah, thank you all for watching. I'll be uh, trying to film some more videos soon. And goodbye.